Hi, Brain Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, like it or not, as we have been talking about, Mozilla is moving closer to Chrome and Edge with the Firefox web browser, bringing it more in line with those and other mainstream web browsers. And in regards to this, I let you know a couple of days ago that work on MKV video support had started in the nightly version. I'll leave the video linked. And in regards to another upcoming feature that looks like Mozilla wants to bring it closer to Chrome and Edge as an example, is currently in the stable, if we head to the sidebar, we have our open AI chatbot option. And if we click on that, you've got other chatbots you can add like Claude, ChatGPT, Google Gemini, Mistral, and so on. Those are the four that are listed in the stable. Now, if we head over to the nightly version, which is an early preview version, and we do the same, we can see now that Mozilla has added Microsoft Copilot to Firefox's sidebar as a built-in AI chatbot option that's available now. If we click on that, continue, there we go. And there's Copilot, like it or not, in the sidebar of the Firefox web browser in early preview. And currently, it looks very similar to what we get over in Edge. And we get three responses, Quick Response, Think Deeper, and Smart GPT-5. Now, it goes without saying that not all Firefox users are welcome in these changes. And I have found that users of Firefox are a bit resistant to AI additions, which is totally understandable in the browser. And another reason, as I've posted, video will also be linked. AI features in Firefox are also causing serious performance issues, leading to CPU sparks and battery drain. I'll leave the video linked. So there's a couple of reasons why avid Firefox users are a little bit skeptical to get all this AI starting to be pushed into the browser. Now, as mentioned earlier, although Mozilla is moving closer to Chrome and Edge, both of which are relying heavily and are leaning heavily into AR, the difference in Firefox is at least the Copilot and the other AR options in regards to the chatbots are optional. So you can turn this off. So you just right click, click on Remove Copilot, and there we go. So now there are no AI chatbots active. You have to select one and then continue. So you've got the choice using Firefox, unlike Chrome and Edge. So that's the big difference here. So I think it's only a matter of time before this makes it to stable. And let me know in the comments, what do you think of all this AI being pushed into Firefox? Let me know your thoughts. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.